Edinburgh is engulfed with performers who are using every nook and cranny of the city and every stunt to showcase their talent. There are no rules here or artistic limits. The festival is open to anyone with a story to tell, and that makes it a unique environment. Good morning, reservations. Thank you for holding. How can I help you? Yeah, this is Bryce calling from Naomi Campbell's office. Marcus Brigstock has already made it big as a comedian on TV, but he keeps coming uh, this back. Is Sam. Sam, how are you? It attracts everybody, like huge name comics to brand new people waiting to be discovered. Yeah. He started out playing to empty seats, but can now sell hundreds of tickets a night. I was discovered here. I won the BBC New Comedian uh, Award in 96, met TV and radio producers, and then more importantly, Edinburgh is where I got good at what I do you know, because you really have to push yourself to be successful here. Here at Edinburgh, the competition is brutal, with over 3,000 shows all trying to attract the same audience. It's all about how many flyers they can get out or how many posters they can stick up around the city. Hello! Amy Haverska is making her stand-up debut at the festival in a tiny venue with a lukewarm crowd. My dad's catchphrase is, you've not lived till you found yourself alone in a field of horses that are on fire. <laughs> Which is inappropriate at Pony Club. She says she has to be in Edinburgh to get notice, but will come away out of pocket. I will lose a few grand at the end and I would have still had a good Edinburgh comparatively. It's crazy, isn't it? Everyone makes money apart from the artist. But money isn't the main objective. Artists are here to hone their craft and hopefully find an agent. People who are performing here right now will end up touring internationally, will end up on television, will end up in films made by Hollywood producers. The next big thing could be found in a laundrette, a church or even on a bus. Just some of the spaces transforming into stages. And with costs soaring, artists know that performing here might break the bank but not their spirit. Charlie Angela Al Jazeera, Edinburgh.